But but then the but but in the last two years, because you know my ex used to be on that side, so I was like, oh God, this is a flip of West. But y'all mentality is light. I really do like your hustle, and um, you know it's a difference between the West and the East Side. You know. Yeah, but now we all merge together. I think when we were younger, it was a difference. I'm glad. Yeah. I, I, I love to see that. Because yeah. it's, usually it's like folks from the East don't like people from the West. And we got to stop it. That's why our city's right. not coming together with this music. And I'm just jealous of cities that are doing well with it. Right. So what, what are some of the things that you're doing with your business? Like, you're, you're the producer? Yeah. Okay. Or what, what, what are you doing to change it? Like, our, even though you might not like this, this clique of a group, you can still work with them or... How would we, how would we start the process of getting rid of that? Uh, how we normally deal with each other. I mean, everybody really just gotta set the ego aside and be willing to work with other people and stop just trying to just work with a certain group of people. We willing to work with anybody that's gonna work with us and try to get something accomplished. Absolutely. That's why we we collaborated with with Mo Gang right You know what I'm saying? Did you know what I'm saying? A couple things with them. It's like you know you gotta diversify. You, you gotta actually be able to be willing to work with people. Otherwise, ain't nobody gonna get no work. If ain't nobody willing to work with nobody, yeah. we all fail. Yeah. Right. But not, not many people see that. No, you got you got a lot of people that just are out for sale and don't see the bigger picture of it all. Right. Right. So, right. You actually got people out here robbing folks. You know what I'm saying? Trying to take what they got instead of. Asking that person, if you just simply ask a person, they might give it to you. You ain't got to put a gun to them. True enough. True enough. Now, who, who would you compare yourself to that's already in the industry? Me, personally, I would say, and I would have to sort of go with, he ain't really in the industry right now, but I would say more like a DMX type or Pac, but he's not here no more because what we spit in is real life. Everything that we're talking about is things that we didn't went through. So, that's what I would say. Yeah, uh, uh, if I really don't like to compare myself to people, but if I had to, I sort of put, yeah, like a DMX or a mystical, you know what I'm saying, along those lines. Okay. So what are you hoping that the people get out of your music? Well, to tell you the truth, I just hope that my music can make a person feel that mode. I just like, the, what, the reason that I like music so much is because it, it shifts, it shifts people's modes, you know what I'm saying? You can take, you can be feeling a real bad way and put on a song that you absolutely love and it can change that whole perception. Mm -hmm. okay. And that's the main thing that I love about music and I'm just hoping to do the same thing in somebody else's, in somebody else's life. I want to make an impact, you know? I want people to be able to understand, well, we didn't have as much as the next man, and at the same time, we continue to struggle, and we continue to push forward, and we continue to go ahead and make it, and they can do the same thing as well. Okay. Who are some artists that you look forward to working with? <laughs> man, yeah, you know, I would actually love to do a song with either Mystical or Busta Rhymes or Twister. I, I would love to do one with Nas. We might be able to get one with Fire over there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I mean, why are you saying? I mean, That'd be a nice little collab. Yeah, we need to start. make that happen. Yeah, that's the start, and to have love, and we, you know, it's, this is. I, I'm, I'm excited about uh, Detroit. Um, so, what you, you guys have coming up? Well, actually, we're still trying to promote this album that we put out. We got it on CDBaby.com. iTunes. Yeah, we we really trying to really promote this and push this. And so really do y'all go to different spots like Celebrity, you know, I mean, um, Ebony Showcase, or just places where you can just be seen, uh, clubs or different spots? Have you jumped into that yet? We, or kinda... we starting to try to get off into that right now because we just now got finished with the album and we're trying to get everything rolling now. Mm -hmm. So What's the name of the album? Spurry's Not an Option. Okay. Is not an option. Not at all. <laughs> yeah, so we got a um, Facebook, we got a YouTube, so they can check the video out on YouTube. So we're making things happen. Okay, so before you guys get out of here, um, why don't you tell everyone where they can uh, contact you or where they can get in touch with you at? 
Uh, you can go to King's Loyalty at Facebook, or you can go to um, King's Loyalty E N T at Gmail dot com, and we could go from there. Now, was something that we didn't do if we got a couple of minutes. Just, we didn't get a chance to do it with fire, but could you spit some? Oh, you want to freestyle? Yeah, I just want to. Yeah. Keep it quick. Keep it quick. Ah, uh, that's keep gonna be hard for him to keep it quick. I can do it. You don't want me to do it? Because you gotta keep it clean. And don't slip. Uh-uh. Don't slip. I made a mistake. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Don't slip. Them expensive mistakes. Oh, well, I ain't gonna try it. Right. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna try it. But yes, I'm gonna check you out. I'm on your. You want to say it one more time? You know what? Actually, I get. You know what? You could. No. Nah, yeah. Just, just get away. Facebook. Check us out at King's Loyalty on Facebook. You could check us out at um King's Loyalty E N T at Gmail dot com. And I want to say, uh, if I can, that give a uh, shout out to the people that helped us um, complete the album. We got um, Mo, we got the Avenue, we got Mr. Black from Mo Games Records, we got Cashmere, and we got Wade. Okay. I was about to give y'all my home phone number, but I'm going to you fire, dude. They got to get to blowing it up. 248. <laughs> 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 well, I appreciate you fellas coming out tonight. Can right. I just say, Thank I want to give a shout out to the city, man. I love this city, man. Love y'all. Okay. Love the city. We, I, I love the city. <laughs> oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, 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 you said it if I asked for it. Can I get your chain out? Oh, and your bracelet? Or do I got to pull it out? Can I get the glasses? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hold on. Let's go to a vote. Thank you guys for coming out again. All right. Thank, Thank you for having us. All right. All right.